Today I'm going to show you how to get the new epic crafted items in Season of Discovery Phase 2. These crafted items are unbelievably strong and are absolutely best in slot, so of course they come with a quest that sends you all around the world, and here's how you do it. First, while you're in the new Gnomergan raid, you will need to find a drop and loot it called the Grime Encrusted Salvage. This is an homage to the old Grime Encrusted Ring quest in Gnomergan, so you're going to take it to that same place. You'll turn it into the Salvage Matic 9000 and you need three silver to do this, but as soon as you do, you will receive a quest from the mob right next to you, the little gnome named Ziri. Ziri will give you the quest Salvaging the Salvage Matic, and this is the main quest we need to do. This requires 10 Mithril Bars, 5 Greater Mystic Essence, 3 GG12 Cartridge Fuses, which are items that now drop within the raid, but they are not bind on pickup, so you can find them on the auction house. Most likely right now, they'll be very expensive. You'll probably want to find them in the raid, but you need three of these. And then the big one is the pristine G7 core processor. Now to get the core processor is going to be a bit of a journey. Head out the front of Nomergan and head over here to kill the tech bot. He will drop a corroded processor, and this will give you a new quest called the corroded core, which asks you to look for someone that knows how to basically fix the core. What we're going to do is just head right back to Ziri and talk to him again. He will actually send us on our next quest. Head down to Booty Bay and right near the Gnomergan teleporter or right outside of the inn, you will find another gnome named Scooty. Scooty will give you our next quest called Quadrangulate, and we're going to need to head all across Azeroth to find four beacons. The first beacon is underwater here in Duskwalla Marsh at 5713 on the map. Loot this and we're off to the next one. Now head to Desolus at the top of this mountain at 3273 on the map to get your second one. The third beacon is down in Tanaris at 3727 on the map. You'll You'll find it here on the ground. And the last one is here in Feralis on the Isle of Dread at the bottom of the aisle here at 2893. Now head back to Booty Bay and talk to Scooty one more time. He's going to teleport you to Feralis and you're going to need to pick up the quest Warranty Claim. This asks you to bring Wonderful Wonder Gear a charged Void Core, and the reward for this will be that pristine core we were asking about earlier. Now here in the Isle of Dread, you'll need to farm some of the Nagas because you need them to drop the spent Void Core. And once you loot this, we're off to Desolus for the last item we need. In Desolus at Manorox Coven, you will farm the demons until they spawn a shadowy figure. This is kind of random and it can take a while or it could be really quickly. Once you see the shadowy figure, just talk to him and go through all of the motions and he will give you a Moat of Darkness. Then you'll use the Moat of Darkness to combine these two items, but head back to Booty Bay now because then you can teleport instantly back to Feralis. Now you just turn in the quest to receive your pristine G7 core processor and now all all you need if you don't have it so far are those cartridge fuses and the other items you can get either off the auction house or dropping in the raid to be able to turn it in within the raid. And once you complete this and turn it in, you will actually now have an option to buy any of the crafted item recipes from Ziri. Congratulations, guys. And if you liked this guide, it would be a massive help if you liked the video and subscribe to the channel. We're on our way towards 100,000, and I'm going to do like some massive, massive giveaways, like a year year of game time and like six months of game time for like 10, 20 people. I don't know, but I just thank you for all of the support and enjoy season of discovery phase two more guides soon, as soon as I get some sleep. So I'll see you all on the next one.